So this is the switch box. And the switch box is mounted on the inside of the microwave, right about here, but a little further in. And this black piece on the front that depresses comes out of this little hole here. And so you can imagine when the microwave door closes, it would press this switch in. And this would trigger these little, this little black thing to push inside. And now what should be happening is you take a functional switch that goes in this position here. When the microwave door closes, this depresses, this sliding thing hits that little black button on top and makes that clicking sound. Just like that. And so this was the broken switch on the right side of the left side of the microwave. When this went all the way in, it would fully depress the switch, but as you can see there's no audible sound. You actually have to physically push this down yourself once the switch is fully depressed to hear that clicking sound and to ensure that the circuit is closed. So this switch was not closing, which made the microwave door think that it was not fully closed and the microwave would not start. Uh, unfortunately, this is the current state of the microwave with the entire front piece just hanging off. But anyway, yeah, that was my two hours of debugging my microwave mechanical issue.